God. Oh. What up, everybody? It's your boy, Eddie Brrrr. Durio 1000 Brrrr. Hopefully, you're having a great day. In this video here, let me make sure. In this video here, we are going to look at how women <laughs> in a public environment grade themselves on attractiveness and this is why i say don't listen to women when they tell you how to approach women how to talk to women and all this other shit it's all they have no clue on what men think they don't need, they don't understand men all they do is try to look as pretty as they can and you know fill up time you know so this is basically women. This is how they put themselves, judge themselves, rated themselves on attractiveness. And they put, let me make sure. They put this little tiny white girl all the way at, as least attractive and the black girl as most attractive. Now, I don't know what world or reality these individuals are living in, but this is not anything on how men would rank these girls on attractiveness nowhere first of all this doesn't even reflect society black women are unmarried and as compared to their white counterparts who are a lot of them more a higher percentage of them are married than black women so there's that so Obviously, she can't be number one because society does not seek her out as number one. But on my ranking this, this one in the middle would be number one. Um, the other three, well, she would, this one or this one could be number she need not. Um, so this one would be number one. This one would be number two. The tall blonde. The. Probably. Between these two here. She would probably be number three, then number four, and then number five. Okay, that's how I personally would rank them. But let's watch. Definitely go up. I'm definitely more quiet. I just talk a lot. Don't get it. You have such a pretty smile. You see that the black girl was about to switch places. And I think this is what <laughs> I think this is what the girl was going for. She thought that she was more attractive than her. And she knew that, and that's why she was about to move. Watch. Watch again. Don't get it. You have such a pretty smile. 
You see how she was about to switch? <laughs> I think the black girl knows she not number one. <laughs> she don't want to say anything. And the other girls are like, uh, they don't. That's the thing. They don't want to make decisions. Yours is pretty soft, so white, and so is yours. And you have a mole right here, which is kind of cute. You know, <laughs> I hate an accent. You're scared of how you're doing it. Because you're so pretty. Oh my god. I know. <laughs> like sunburn turning red. <laughs> <laughs> and I freaking. Alright, so you can yeah, sit here and kiki. What? And yeah, you idea. can see can the body it. language. What would they set me at? <laughs> Check out the body language. You know what? I have an idea. We can hold hands and then we're all. <laughs> We're, connected. We're connected. We're <laughs> connected. Send a message. Now this girl here, number two, she knows. Look at her body language. She knows something is a little awkward. She knows. Yeah. She's pretty in the face. That that one right there is probably the prettiest one in the face. The one in the middle. She has the cutest face. She's cute too. Um, well, okay, what well, well, would they set me at? <laughs> you know what? I have an idea. We can hold hands and then we're all number one. <laughs> We're connected. <laughs> we're connected. <laughs> Send a message. Yeah. This one is so motherfucking pretty. She she is the prettiest of them. Now, if it was just on face, she would be number, she would be above number, well, not, well, not above number one, number one, number one, but she is cute as a button. Now, we're going to fast forward to this, because basically, the guy's going to rank them, and we're going to give a final ranking. So this is the final ranking. Black to the back. She went from first to last, which is how society would rank her. I would that was that was close. That was that was remember I said that she was number one. Overall most attractive. Her and her these three well these two could switch for number the number two spot, honestly. They could this this girl's body is better than her body, but she has a much cuter face than her. But again, no disrespect to the girls. Thank you for participating. And, you know, all of you all have something to offer. All right. So, again, All of you all have something to offer and you know you all are all look good you know all of you all are definitely presentable and I bang each and every one of you seems like a guy's choice <laughs> well yeah it's a guy's choice I mean, that's what matters. Yeah. This is this is <laughs> the last thing that you last caught me off guard. Yeah. I don't think I should be here. <laughs> uh, when she says, "I don't think I should be here," it's kind of like a slight at the other girls, implying that 
other girls are uglier than her. You know, but hey, it is what it is. That's how men rank you. That's why you that's how you are. But the number one girl in 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 life, is, the number one sought after woman in life is the wife, the high value woman. Yeah, I'm not really sure what the guys factored in to get there, but I think that the girls have like a more open-heartedly. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. This is Eddie. I'm out.